Hi, my name is Robert. Please read the comments in the About section of this video. It has valuable information and updates. My YouTube channel has a disclaimer video that I encourage you to watch. And please, like, share, and subscribe. I hope you find what you're looking for. Thank you very much for watching. Ended day 28 in the Savannah, Georgia area after spending a fun full pack day in the Charleston, South Carolina area. Uh, helped a guy with an 850 turbo there. It's a 96 model, had EGR. Man, these crossovers are just killing me. Somebody did an EGR delete on it, had a couple of issues that were not that difficult, just kind of lingering. I think he might have a bad fuel pressure uh, regulator at any rate. Um, in the Savannah, Georgia area this morning, visiting a family member. I'm going to go through Jacksonville, Florida, and into Orlando, uh, Florida. So I should be in Orlando, Florida, hopefully uh, before late evening, maybe around 6-ish. If there's anybody I need to stop, meet and greet, or something like that, please let me know. I'll be in the Orlando area probably till Sunday morning. I'm going to have to reverse the door opening direction on this Frigidaire Affinity dryer. Sometimes it's an inconvenience to have it open in one way or another, especially depending on your washing machine location. As you can see, the washing machine is open in one way and the dryer is open in the other way and they're backed up against each other and the downside of that is you got to bring your clothes around both doors to get them loaded in. So there you have it. Now the door opens closer to the washing machine and it's easier to load and unload. So you close the door, set your thing, hit start, make sure it dries without your door popping open and it's striking your closed door switch and you're good to go. Kicking off day 29, I uh, swapped out a door on a drive. Talked to some Audi tech people about my nephew's car problems or my niece's car problems. Now I'm headed to Orlando, Florida, and I'm having charging issues. Charging is bouncing between 11.9 on the low scale to 12.4. Every once in a while it goes up to 12.7. So. It's kind of a sign I got a regulator or charging issue going on with the car. I'm going to have to get that checked out in Orlando for sure. Hopefully I'll make it there without any problems. Pulled off the road to get gas, restarted the car, and now the charging system is normal. So for some reason the charging system thought that it should be charging at 12.2 instead of 13 point whatever. So I got to watch that soon. I probably got a voltage regulator going out. Well, not much happened today. Uh, messed with that dryer, did some research for my nephew's Audi. We are now in the Orlando, Florida area. Did not uh, make the meet and greet in Jacksonville, Florida. Uh, I, I guess it may be easier if uh, some of the meet and greet folks tried to meet me halfway or something, but it's hard working around people's work schedules, stuff like that. But uh, at any rate, we'll be here probably till Sunday morning. Plan to go to Miami Sunday morning, spend a few hours in Miami, and probably try to make it back here in the Orlando area Sunday evening. So if you're in the area, you need to, need to stop by, check something, try to help you fix something, let me know. If you feel that this information was useful, please like it and share it with your social media friends. You can subscribe to my channel so that you will get notifications of future videos that I post. You can follow me on Twitter, and if you need to contact me directly, please visit my website. And if you have any questions, leave them below, and someone or myself will reply to them. Again, thank you very much for watching.